ago, there was a vast multiversal war. All-knowing timekeepers emerged, bringing peace by reorganizing the multiverse into a single timeline. Well, in case you missed it, yes, Loki's first episode literally explains to us the multiverse of madness. And they do it in that same playful way like the first time they explained to us the importance of the Infinity Stones in Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 1. If you really pay attention during the scene in Loki's first episode, you get an idea of how this is setting up the multiverse of madness and what is coming. And what we learn is that we are following the sacred timeline, a predetermined timeline that is overseen by these timekeepers. They make sure that everything falls into place. Everything has happened and everything that will happen, they know about it, they make sure it's following the course of predetermined set motions. Now, as they also establish in this, that there is a multiverse that exists. Again, multiverse exists, this is sort of a convergence point. That's what the TVA is. Now, when things happen, like variants that end up leaving their timeline or disturbing things that happen, they become these nexus points. And these points are very important because if you look at it, Wanda also mentions the nexus. If you look at Doctor Strange, the next one is Multiverse of Madness. As that little PSA says, if there is nexuses that are created or exist and variants that aren't accounted for, this has huge ramifications, like leading to a, as the TV series puts it, madness multiverse war. Meaning that this is 100% setting us up for what is coming in the next few entries and how the MCU is going to be affected in a long and short term, really. So now, since we understand more about the multiverse and what is at stake and, uh, you know, what is at cost and how everything predetermined is allowed to happen, but once you step off the path, it causes these ripples that have to be accounted for. I think now you start to understand that the multiverse is going to have a bigger impact on the MCU than just the upcoming Doctor Strange film. We know it's directly tying into Spider-Man. We know that Loki season will be dealing with his own ramifications by stepping out of line. Now, what happens during the course of the series where they're doing this and not really paying as close attention to what's happening elsewhere is probably going to factor into it because there is some interesting dialogue in the first episode that hints towards the multiverse being more dangerous than we've ever thought. So my guess is that by the time we get to it in Doctor Strange in the Multiverse of Madness, which is both words they drop here, we're going to see it unfold in some pretty insane ways. 